Hi guys and welcome to the Football Cards and Stickers Match Attacks Premier League 2015-16 season. Uh, as you see this is where we recreate uh, every game week which is played in the Barclays Premier League for that season uh, by opening free packets of the Topps Match Attacks 2015-16 uh, trade and card collection and any players pulled within those packs will score goals for their respective clubs in those uh, respective fixtures for that game week. So let's head over to the game week to be played. So guys welcome to game week 13 of the uh, Match Attacks Premier League 2015-16 season. As you can see Manchester City uh, remain top. They're closely followed by Everton and Arsenal though. Uh, meanwhile at the bottom of the table there you can see Villa back in the bottom three. Uh, after Bournemouth's victory in game week 12 and uh, they're joined by the two uh, northeastern clubs Newcastle and Sunderland um, some great fixtures today let's just run through those for you uh, we have Chelsea versus Norwich Crystal Palace v Sunderland Everton v Villa Man City versus Liverpool of course the leaders entertaining Liverpool there Newcastle v Leicester Southampton v Stoke Swansea v Bournemouth, Spurs versus West Ham in the London Derby, Watford versus Manchester United, and finally West Bromwich Albion against Arsenal. So, without further ado, let's get this game week straight underway. Here we go. So, first up, we have, as you see, a man the match card there. Uh, Keeson Young of Swansea, who are playing Bournemouth at home, they take the lead. Followed by Matt Ritchie, another uh, frequent goal scorer in this. And that's actually an equaliser in that game. There, Swansea won, Bournemouth won. Stoke City take the lead at Southampton through Johnny Walters. Meanwhile, uh, Crystal Palace has uh, taken the lead at home to Sunderland through Damien Delaney. Of course, Sunderland getting their first win of the season in the last uh, game week. Gareth Barry has given Everton the lead at home to Villa. Meanwhile, this beast of a guy, uh, Anthony Marshall, has given Manchester the United the lead at newly promoted Watford there. Craig Gardner has given uh, the Baggies the lead at home to, uh, at home to Arsenal. And meanwhile, Ben Luan has uh, scored for Leicester City away at Newcastle there. Next up, Yoshida has got the equaliser at St Mary's for Southampton, uh, home to Stoke City. Uh, while Swansea retake the lead there through Kyle Barkley. They now lead uh, Bournemouth by two goals to one. Next pack, uh, the equaliser again for Bournemouth there through Charlie Daniels this time. That's now 2 all. Uh, the leaders, Manchester City, take the lead at home to Liverpool through their iconic uh, captain, Vincent Company. Jack Wilshire has got the equaliser at West Bromwich Albion for Arsenal. Screechy Boy has uh, doubled Manchester United's advantage away at Watford there. Eric Dyer has got the first goal in the London derby against West Ham at White Hart Lane. Fuchs has done it. Fuchs has got on the score sheet. He's doubled Leicester's advantage. Fuchs in L. Uh, Colaccini gets one back, though. Rudy Gested of Villa has, uh, has scored uh, the equaliser at Goodison Park as well. So Everton having a bit of trouble uh, dealing with Villa. James McArthur has doubled Palace's lead at home to Sunderland. Meanwhile, uh, Spurs have doubled uh, their advantage through Christian Eriksen's star player there, you see, at home to West Ham United. On the next pack, and Santi Gazzola, there he is, the pig himself. He has given Arsenal a two-goal to one lead. Let's get rid of that uh, logo there, it's not counted. Uh, so we have Stoke City have uh, retook the lead at St Mary's through Glenn Johnson, their ex-Liverpool fullback. Yannick Bellassi has hit the third for Palace at home to uh, Sunderland, as you see there. Galloway, the young fullback, has uh, re uh, given Everton the advantage at home to Villa. 
Meanwhile, Bournemouth uh, take the lead and double that advantage through Lee Tomlin and Joshua King, as you see there. They now lead by four goals to two at Swansea. Emery Chan has got a late equaliser for Liverpool at Manchester City. Ki Sung Young has uh, scored his second of the game for Swansea. However, it doesn't look like it's going to be enough, actually. And Aidan Hazard, 101-101, has got an injury time winner, as you see, for Chelsea at Stamford Bridge against Norwich City. So, the final scores for this uh, game week 13 of the Match Attacks Premier League 2015-16 are as follows. Chelsea 1, Norwich City 0, Crystal Palace 3, Sunderland 0, Everton 2, Villa 1, Manchester City 1, Liverpool 1, Newcastle 1, Leicester 2, Southampton 1, Stoke City 2, Swansea 3, Bournemouth 4, Spurs 2, West Ham United 0, uh, Watford 0, Manchester United 2, and West Bromwich Albion 1, Arsenal 2. So as you can see, it's had quite an effect on the uh, table there at the top. As you can see, we have new leaders, which are Everton. Uh, they lead the table by one point from Manchester City and Arsenal. Meanwhile, at the bottom three, uh, they're looking ever increasingly detached. They are Aston Villa, Newcastle and Sunderland. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this game week uh, 13. Don't forget to smash that like button as always, guys. And of course, I'll see you guys all in future uh, Football Cards and Stickers Match Attacks Premier League Encounters. But until then, ciao.